Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. I made a video about a particular pipsqueak, a particular delinquent, a particular ruffian, an individual, a fool, block headed fool, who who's coming out and burning the Quran on a weekly basis, uh, thinking that he is harming Islam and the Muslims uh, thereby. Unfortunately for him, I have to say, he's come out and done it again. Let's take a look at the video of him being aggressive and burning uh, the Quran, coming out of masajid, people trying a uh, threatening behavior to people, uh, and come back and see. So as you can see, this fool thinks he's getting something uh, done. He's achieving something, that the objective is being uh, met. I'll tell you what objective is being uh, met. What objective is being met is that you're actually helping us raise money to establish Islam and Muslims in Norway. And as I promised, every time you burn a Quran, it's a promise of mine. Yes, and the promise of the Muslim community. It was the promise of the Muslim community. That every time... That you burn the Quran, there'll be 50,000 euros to your name. That you'll be yourself the chief fundraiser. Thank you so much, Lars Thorn, for the fundraising by doing antagonizing the Muslims, making the Muslims angry, making the Muslims give charity, which is what you're doing, which is what it is now. You're encouraging the Muslims to do this. As we promise to the people that every time this man burns a Quran and he creates a ruckus in our community and he creates some problems in our community that you're going to yourself last as the chief fundraising officer you are going to now help us raise another hundred thousand since this is the time for everybody to go full throttle to honestly don't just let your right hand spend and forget about don't even inquire don't even look back as the prophet muhammad sallam, said that mal or wealth does not depreciate from giving in charity. And on the flip side, one thing which we or individuals on the Day of Judgment, maybe like Lars Thorne himself, who's going to be burning in the hellfire himself, inshallah, if he continues at the pace that he's at, burning in hellfire, yeah, is that they will be saying, the one thing they'll be regretting is the fact that they haven't even given charity. We don't want to be like these individuals who regret not giving the charity in days like golden days like this. You must give the charity. We must go forward. We must keep, continue the cause. Wassalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh.